What's up dudes, Max here. Things are getting a little crazy. We're just under three weeks from E3 2019 and there's a lot of stuff leaking. There's a lot of stuff people are talking about. I'm gonna hold off on some things, but uh, some of it has me very excited. And one of them is an announcement that happened last E3 at the PlayStation conference that was one of the most unexpected things and happened way quicker than I thought it would. Uh, happening about a year and a half after the launch of the initial game and that was for Neo. Neo 2 was announced and we haven't heard anything. I think I heard some stories about how a lot of the gameplay elements are gonna be changing and how a lot of the core aspects of Neo are going to be uh, adjusted in Neo 2, but that was like rumors of someone that got a hold of the game that was playing it. I really enjoyed Neo. I didn't end up going through all of its DLC, but the core campaign I really liked and I liked how much combat and action it had. I liked the fact that the environments weren't as good as Souls games, but it was very much a Souls game through and through. But I, I liked the combat more. I thought the actual physical combat of the characters was a bit more satisfying than a Souls-style game. So I'm hoping to see some of that. This is a gameplay trailer, and I want to see what stuff can be done gameplay-wise. I hear there's also a, a, a test, like an alpha slash beta test of some kind at the end of this thing, so that must mean the game isn't that far out. Uh, I hope so. But let's take a look and see what the hell Neo 2 is looking like. Now the big question is going to be, is, uh, is Ryu Hayabusa going to show up in some fashion? This I do not know, but this I hope so. There's like Hayabusa armor in the first game a little bit. Team Ninja this. That's what Team Ninja's been working on. Instead of all that other stuff they've been working on lately. Okay. Wow, at its core, it is looking very, very much like Neo, but probably a bit more shiny. It almost looks like it's like an expansion in separate ways. Like some of these characters look very similar. Holy shit. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Don't look at, the, don't look at me that way, lady. Oh my God. Yeah, crazy, horrible, insane Japanese uh, death monsters. Uh oh. Oh, wow. So you get a double trigger. Like an actual appropriate double trigger. This is a bit different than the, uh, like the different spirit things you had before. Whoa, you can summon undead archers. It looks like you can actually use enemies from the world in combat now. Uh, 24, 5, oh, 5, 24. Man, it almost, yeah, it, it really looks like just more Neo. Like, like, that, that's, that's the big takeaway from this entire trailer is that were you like Neo, we're just gonna give you a whole bunch more Neo as Neo. Uh, and I don't think that's specifically a bad thing because Neo was a really fun game. Uh, and the, the way that you go through, I, I didn't in, enjoy or really partake in a lot of the multiplayer components of the game. And I'm wondering if that's what they're going to be messing around with now, if there's actually going to be proper, like, more PvP than there usually is, stuff like that. Uh, but I thought it looked really good. I thought, uh, I think visually, from an aesthetics, it, it looks like Neo 1, like, a lot. Uh, but I'm curious if they're going to be launching on other platforms. I know the, the beta is going to be on PlayStation 4. But I'm really curious if there's going to be a PC launch at the start, because I'm wondering if PC Neo ended up doing really well. I kind of wish I ended up playing the PC version early on. But this was back in those, like, early, like, PS4 Pro days where it's like, oh, you get the Pro version and you can get, you know, frame rate mode, you can get better visuals mode, stuff like that. Um, but overall, I think it looks great. I think Neo was one of my most fun games I played back on the PlayStation 4. And, uh... Going into the PS5, I'm wondering if this is going to be one of those crossover games if we eventually get a release date on that stuff in the future. But, uh, I like it. I wasn't blown away by it because it does look like more Neo. But I don't think that's specifically a bad thing because that game was a hell of a lot of fun.